I'm Peter Haddock and I'm here in the Shab Valley on the A417 as part of our epic journey of the building of this really important road here. Mark, as usual, the Shab Valley, it's windy, <laughs> but the Shab Valley, last time we were here, we're doing the tree clearance and now we've got that layer you were talking about, which is the drainage levels. Tell me where we are right now and, and what's been happening. Well, you're right, Peter. Oh, so, yeah, it's been a while since we were last in here and uh, we saw the tree clearance going on. Um, but yeah, as you can see, we've cleared all the vegetation off. We've done the foundation preparation. We've had it approved by the design. We've got down to a solid formation. All been approved by the designers. We've placed the first layer of geotextile, of white geotextile. Half a metre of drainage, single size 6C drainage blanket material on top of that. Another layer of geotextile. And then we're placing the fill on top, which is coming from the area we saw earlier on crushing. So why are these levels important and why is that material important that you've just talked about there? When you've got a bowl like this and it's naturally taking water from, from the ground, it's always going to perch in the ground. You can never alleviate the groundwater coming in. So what it does, it enables that clean layer of, of single sized stone, the water that comes in through the ground and through the embankments filtrates through and it heads off to the bottom corner. There's a big pond in the bottom corner. It's naturally falling down to that bottom corner down there into the pond. It's where it stays. So, right, that's really important, folks. We get that right. And then you've got testing uh, of that. You, you, you actually did some preliminary works on that to, to make sure that that's all the, the, the right standard, doesn't it, as well? Because it's quality that's important. When you're filling that up, that layer is cru crucial to you, right, isn't it? it? It is. Yeah, absolutely right. And as we come up with the fill material, we're, we're putting in a series 600 specification. It all comes in. Um, put it in generally about 300 mil, compact it down to about 250. Every lift is tested in here. You've got to keep records of those lifts coming all the way up to the top. And so all the way to the top is actually where we're standing, virtually. Uh, give or take, we've got another couple of meters to go on top of where we stood. Oh, right. Um, wow. we're, we're roughly between... 18 and 20 meters of filling here see on the far side and what we're doing here once again we, we've mentioned this landscape led scheme a lot of tree planting going on on the scheme the gradients of the embankments here are, are one in three you can see right across on the far side where we strip the topsoil that's the toe of our embankment as we bring the fill up right so folks this is why the shab valley is the earth movers dream that we're calling it with this project because it really is using material just from down the road then up here and then all those different layers going in. So the surveying, the, the testing, and then the delivery of this all in now, crushing and screening on site so that we're not bringing in too much extra material to the job site at all, are we? No, no, everything has a, everything has a home. Everything gets a, gets a reuse. Um, we don't have any any surplus. Really. We have a bit of surplus topsoil at the end, which will go in the detrunking phase of the old road. Right. And we take the old road out. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it's a, it's a lifetime haul, really, short distance. Big about 600,000 cube, just under it here. A lot to go. And there's a lot to go, folks, and we'll be seeing this as we get up in the levels. Me and Mark will be getting a bit more easy to walk down through here, won't yeah. you, Mark? It will, absolutely, absolutely, <laughs> yes. And it, and it opens up so fast. It's changing every day. You know, we're putting, putting as much gear, gear in here as we can. Um, you know, every time I come down, it's changing. And that's it. We've really got to push on. This is our critical path now for this summer. We've got a big structure to go in here. This, as we've said before, this is the hub of the scheme. This is where all the roads come in and meet and, dis uh, and disperse off in other directions. Big structure in here. We've got to get this structure up uh, this, this year. We've got to start, get this fill up, get this structure going later on this year. So, folks, hopefully next time it'll be a bit sunnier and less windy, Mark, but it seems to be when we're at the top of the Shab Valley here, this is the, the, what you've got to deal with, the Earth Movers dream, and it can be a bit cold even when we're in here in the summer. Great to see you. Thanks, Peter.